Putin must take the first step, break off the war with Ukraine. On Saturday, German Chancellor Olaf Scholz urged Russian President Vladimir Putin to take the first step toward a peaceful resolution in Ukraine. Musi Wykofak Waska, Osenia Chef Nimitskiego Razadu Pedchus Wizati W. Nuthatal W. Brandenburgi. Jednak Nigdi Ni Ma Zadnich Oznik, Z Tok Sai Stani, Odpowidzil Kanslers W. Odpowidzi Na Pitani, C Z Y Moga Sai Optik Negotiatsye Pokajau. Pisa Portal Tageshau.de, Scholz Oswodchel Taxi. Z jest goto panauni porosmaviach z putinum. Jednak dodal, z jednak bilobi sen tilko wtedy, gdy by putin bile zakladani du ruchu. Ni mazna shastak wywarad press g, zaznichel. Ukraine, Kiev, on Saturday, the Ukrainian military announced that troops were actively engaged in pushing back Russian forces stationed on the eastern bank of the Dnieper River. This comes a day after Ukraine asserted that it had captured multiple bridgeheads on that bank, which separates the partially occupied Kherson region from the rest of the country. Get all the information you need in one convenient package. Get the news app from CTV. The establishment of footholds on the Russian-held bank of the Dnieper by Ukraine is a minor but potentially major strategic advance in a war that is otherwise essentially at a truce. According to the Ukrainian military's general staff, their forces successfully fought off 12 Russian attacks over the course of Friday and Saturday. Corporate Stories During his first foreign trip as the top UK diplomat, British Foreign Secretary David Cameron meets with Zelensky. Transported to Belarus. A large number of Ukrainian children research conducted by Yale Passage of record budget by Russian parliament strengthens Putin's support and increases defense spending. Russian strategic barrier is allegedly breached by multiple bridgeheads claimed by Ukrainian Marines. Moscow wants the LGBTQ2S plus movement, labeled as extremist by the U.S. Supreme Court. According to Natalia Humanyuk, spokesperson for Ukraine's Southern Operational Command, the current objective of the Ukrainian military is to push back Russian army units as far as possible, in order to alleviate the situation in the Kherson region's western bank and reduce shelling. Humanyuk said that in response, the Russian military attempted to corner Ukrainian forces using tactical aviation, which included Iranian-made Shahed exploding drones. A wide river naturally divides the southern front along its length. A year ago, Moscow's forces withdrew from Kherson and crossed the Dnieper. Since then, they have routinely shelled Ukrainian-held towns to stop Kyiv's forces from pushing toward Crimea, which Russia has annexed. Meanwhile, according to military officials, air defenses were able to shoot down 29 out of 38 Shahed drones that were launched against Ukraine. A power infrastructure facility in the southern Odessa region was hit by one of the drones that managed to get through, knocking out electricity to 2,000 homes. Protesting corruption and calling for the transfer of public monies to the military, hundreds of people gathered in the nation's capital. There has been a string of protests in Kyiv over municipal projects, and this was the tenth in a row. Demonstrators on Saturday waved Ukrainian flags and carried banners that read, We need drones not stadiums. I've organized demonstrations in more than 100 cities protesting against corruption in Ukraine and for more money, which should go to the army, stated Maria Barbash, an activist with the organization Money for the Armed Forces. The first priority of our budget, local budgets and the central budget, should be the army.